easy drain installation. I'm gonna go over a few tips right here for you for when installing easy drain by NDS. I don't recommend what they sell at Home Depot. It's a really weak pipe. It's actually the weakest pipe that I've ever seen, to be honest with you. Look at the difference here. And these, these are both NDS Easy Drain. This is the contractor version. This is sold at Site One. There's a Site One location in 44 states. If you're watching this in the US, there's a pretty good chance there's a Site One near you. Now, this has some ribs for strength. I don't know if the material's thicker, but I don't have a problem with this pipe. It is four slot staggered. I've covered that in previous videos. This is the same material as what they're putting on pipes that are sleeved or socked. You know how I feel about that. I've covered that in previous videos. I'm gonna show you how to use this product and have success. You're gonna to wanna to line your trench with a good filter fabric. We use the same fabric that all the construction crews that are putting in roads when they put drainage systems under the roads, we're using the same fabric that they use. Now what's nice about this, the contractor version, you could buy it to where the pipe's near the bottom, that's the way I like it. And then there's more aggregate on top. This isn't as big as my stone systems, but it'll move water. I'll, I'll endorse this. I, I'm not gonna use this and I'll get to that in a minute, but if you're a homeowner, you don't have a dump truck, you don't have a trailer, don't have a pickup, and you can repurpose the dirt in your yard somewhere. You can dig a trench, repurpose that dirt somewhere, and then buy this at site one, and line the trench with a good filter fabric. Make sure at the joints, as I've covered in previous videos, this is the, the worst part about the whole deal. You need to put something that's gonna not choke off your system, bottleneck the system. So you need something that the water's gonna run through. If you wanna stick to the gravel free, they sell this without a pipe. Buy one without a pipe, just rip this material and go ahead and take their poly rock and, and pack it really good and then fold your fabric over. Now, when I dump stone in my drains, they pour to the shape of whatever it is I dug out. Whatever I dug around, if I gotta dig around a three foot boulder, if I gotta dig around an old stump, whatever it is, it's gonna just pour to the shape of it. To my point, this was dug with an excavator, which means this has a square, this is a square trench. With a shovel, it would have been more rounded. That's why this is really ideal for a homeowner or a contractor that's not very well equipped. We put in thousands of systems. We pour rock and it pours around the pipe. And if it's square like this, because it was dug with a machine, it's not an issue. This is round. Those square corners, the dirt has to slowly undermine. You're gonna get a lot of settling. So NDS does recommend that you build this up like six inches to avoid saddling. Again, me and my crew, we design a system and the intent in mind is no callbacks, no callbacks. My guys know, if there's callbacks, there's gonna be issues. So with stone, we don't have any settling, we don't have any callbacks. Now I will tell you this, whoever made the claim 50% labor savings, you can watch the previous videos that I made on this product. I'm here to tell you, the people that came up with that work behind a desk. My crew and I talked about it, and whoever came up with that, the marketing team that came up with that, they never put in a French drain, and they work behind a desk. For drainage systems in southeastern Michigan, give us a call.